so hi um today um there arrived new breadboards for me and i don't have to do anything with that company or anything um, but i just wanted to let you uh, be part of the unboxing of uh, some new white breadboards until now i had only um either just such a black uh, breadboard um, with uh, two supply rails of uh, voltage at uh, each end or I had the small white ones um, which only had one supply rail but the classic ones <laughs> which I think these are I didn't have so let's look into this and let's be excited because I really um, when I do my projects uh, also in the YouTube videos and I do it on this black bread boys it's always hard for you to see where the pins exactly are because black has no contrast to the parts i'm using and so let's see what is in here that's just found it funny <laughs> where um yeah this one's from uh from china from shenzhen so um but yeah no, nothing about the producer just coincidence i wanted to be a little bit part of the unboxing so let's see Lots and lots of breadboards in here. I like it very much, and it's exactly what I wanted. So it has this. It's nicely white, so we can um, discard components easily when I plug them in. And um, and also there are different sizes. And we have this nice blue and red. And you already see color coded. Okay, red is the plus. Um, and blue is the minus and that's also for my views very good and also for me I like it very much I always wanted to have these kind of standard red boards and I uh, see there was also some kind of instructions or something in the in the package now it gets interesting what does it read uh, bread board is a construction base for prototype electronics it's used to build and test circuits quickly before finalizing any circuit design and it has many holes into which components like ICs and resistors as well as jumper wires mentioned above can be inserted. The breadboard allows you to easily plug in and remove components. There are two types of breadboards, the one with 400 holes and the other with 830 holes in the package. Ah, interesting. They are in the same using method and internal structure also different in size external structure on the left and right sides of the breadboard there are marked ah, okay they see it like this left left and right they look at it this way left and right side of the breadboard there are marked with red and blue lines and plus and minus this design gives you a notice that the outer two lines of breadboard holes can be used as the extension of plus and minus the middle part of the breadboard is divided into two parts by the notch yeah, so the center notch, notch here, and um, on the left or the right of the remarked number are five holes connected by one metal stripe inside. Or these five holes are interconnected. Uh, so yeah, they may, I think they mean all these five holes are interconnected. Yeah, and this is like it is. So we have here the numbers from 1 to 30 on the small one and to the left of the notch these five um, where the one is this row these five of this row are connected and then from the notch they are no more connected to these five here but they are connected here on the right side these one two three four five ones on the first row and then it's the same with the second row, but the second row is not connected to the first row. But I already explained that in a little other video. So let's close this video. Cool that I have these things now. Thank you for watching and please like or subscribe if you want to see new videos. Thank you.